Hey y'all, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to another video. If you guys are new, hi, my name is Shani Stevens. Thank you so much for clicking to watch this video. So in today's video, as you guys can see by the title, I'm going to be showing you guys how I maintain my silk press, how I add volume, just the whole night process of me maintaining my silk press. That's what I'm going to be showing you guys. So let's go ahead and get right into this video. sleep because I'm about to go to sleep. <laughs> I have my rollers. I usually use the regular styrofoam I think rollers that you can just get from the beauty spa store. They look just like this but I purchased some satin rollers from walmart.com because I just feel like sometimes the roller snags my hair so I was like hmm maybe I should get satin rollers because they say you should be sleeping on satin pillows. So I was like, let me get some satin rollers and see if it works out. So I got these, these right here. So I'm gonna start off by sectioning my hair off in four sections and clipping it out of the way. If you guys are interested in anything that you guys see me using in this video, all the hair tools, combs, I will link everything down below and it will also be available in my Amazon store. All right, so we have four sections of hair. Now I'm just gonna start with this section, split it in two. I'm using some of my styrofoam rollers. I'm just gonna wrap my hair around the roller, lay it flat, and then do this little number so it stays in place. Just to explain it a little bit more, I like to start at the ends of my hair. So I take like the last three inches of my hair and I roll it around itself and I lay it flat around the sponge roller and I kind of pull it taut so that it can hold a curl. Once the ends of my hair is rolled around the roller, I use my pointy finger, I hold my ends down and then I twist the excess hair over the ends of my hair so it holds everything into place and i keep laying my hair flat against the sponge roller until i hit my scalp and then i just secure the roller and move on to the next section of hair also if you are rolling your hair at night you do want to make sure that you brush your strands out you all won't see me brushing my hair out in these clips because i just got finished um, doing a silk press on my hair so it was already detangled so I there was no need for me to brush it but if you are um, putting rollers in your hair at night you do want to make sure that you brush it out and make sure it's detangled just so that when you wake up in the morning everything is smooth selling all you have to do is unwrap your rollers and then um, comb through it with your fingers and you'll be good but yeah do make sure you are detangling your hair and brushing it out before you do um, wrap it in rollers and I also wanted to say that I do wrap my hair away from my face so the same way I would curl my hair is the same way that I put the rollers in so me personally I like my curls to go away from my face so I put the rollers in going away from my face if that makes sense Okay, so I feel like the jumbo rollers are going to slide out of my hair when I go to sleep. So, I'm just going to go back to the foam rollers. I do have some satin rollers in my hair, but it's the small ones. But for up top, the jumbo rollers, I just felt like they were going to fall out. So, I'm replacing it with the foam. No, did I leave out a string of hair? I know I was going to do that. All right, the rollers are in. Now I'm just going to tie it with the scarf. I don't know where I got this from. Um, yeah, I don't know where I got this from. So I'm tie. And I just take this and just tuck it under. And then I just put my bonnet on. Hopefully, this stays on my head. I really hope this stays on my head. I don't think y'all understand. Bonnets, scarves, 
they don't stay on my head when i do have the rollers in it somewhat stays on my head <laughs> i'm gonna take it off for now because i don't want to get hot but yeah i'm gonna go ahead and clean it up so i will see you guys in the morning all right so it is the morning after well the afternoon is about five o'clock And these are the curls. And this is how I preserve the curls. This is how I put more curls on my hair without adding heat back to my hair. Oh, I don't like that curl, but I'm gonna leave it right where I said. Okay, so it kind of looks like I'm taking my hair out recklessly, and I, I kind of am, but when you are taking your rollers down, you do want to take them down in a delicate manner, because if you don't, then that can kind of cause frizzing. If you don't mind frizzing, do what, do what I'm doing here, but if you do mind the frizz, just make sure you take them out in a delicate manner, and then once they are out, wrap them around your finger. It kind of like seals the cuticle. I don't know. It, it does something. <laughs> These are the curls definitely way more curled than they were last night okay sometimes i let my curls fall by themselves and i just finger comb them out but since i did just finish doing a soap press my hair was still fresh so i kind of have to like mold it and move it around just to make sure it lays and falls the way i want it to fall so i just wrapped my hair and then took it back down and that was it i didn't do anything extra i just combed it out by wrapping it and um, I'm just showing you guys how the wrap looks and then I'm just going to let it fall back down and part it down the middle and that is the hair. This side is definitely way more curled than this side. But you know what? It's okay. Okay, I'm gonna stop messing with it because I know my hair is gonna fall by itself. All right, y'all, so this is the finished look. I really hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, go ahead and give me a thumbs up. Comment down below, and if you haven't subscribed already, please be sure to subscribe. It's free. It helps out my channel interact with the video. You know what I'm saying. So, yeah, I really hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you guys are interested in a silk press routine, I will link that video on the screen. And, yes, I am natural because I might get some questions about that. But, yes, I am natural. Um, but, yeah, I love y'all, and I will see you guys in my next video.